our third Disneyland vlog. We are having an amazing trip so far. Today we have a mixed day, so both parks. We don't have anything in apart from lunch at Lamplight Lounge, which is in Disney's California Adventure at 12 o'clock. It's now half past nine. So we've spent this morning just having breakfast here, getting ready. I've been doing my hair a little bit because I'm gonna let it dry naturally curly today. The weather's looking nice again, and we're planning on staying out right until later this evening to see the projections, the Halloween projections on the castle. I'm not sure if they do fireworks in the middle of the week. I need to check it, but it's not completely clear on the schedule, but I think right now the fireworks are only on the weekends, but we'll double check and show you later. If you're new around here, hello, I'm Brogan. I'm here on this trip with my fiance, Benji, who's patiently waiting here. <laughs> There he is. We make home lifestyle travel and Disney vlogs, so make sure you hit subscribe so you don't miss all our future Disney trips and vlogs and adventures that we go on. Without further ado, let's get on the bus. This is what we have today. Spotty spotties. Spotty dress, black and white little tote bag, Aldo, Mickey shoes, polka dot ears. Nice. This is from New Look. This is very old shop Disney. Shoes, Aldo, I said that. Yay! <laughs> We are jumping on the bus and this driver has Buzz and Woody hanging off the mirror. <laughs> he also has some here as well, so sweet. It takes around 15 minutes, which is finding it very easy. This hair, this one, has oh, made a, this oh, one's yeah, made a nice a curl. Yeah, but this one, no, didn't want it. didn't want it, it was like, nah. There's a nice breeze right now, which is yeah. appreciated. So we were just saying on the bus that we slept quite well. Hang on, is that a pin board? We started that, but we got distracted by pins. It was a pin board. We've not found many good pins to trade with they're, yet. It's like they're all exactly the same. Which is a shame, because I think in Florida there's definitely better ones. Yeah. As I was saying, we slept pretty well, and I woke up at half past six, and Benji was not long after me. So I think that's good in terms of jet lag. Yeah, I did, 4.30 I, the day before. I, I did go back to sleep, to be fair. You did till eight, <laughs> and I did all my stories on Instagram. And it was just nice. It was nice to just sort of lay in bed, rest, prepare myself for a big day. We're starting in DCA. Right, in we go. Halloween, this is Halloween, this is Halloween. We've got to play a game of which line is the shortest. All right, we've got to pick our first Genie Plus of the day. What is, we've got lunch at 12, so keep that in mind. Credit coasters now, that's a good shout. Oh, what's the, it's only a 20 minute wait, Yeah, but we still honest. use Genie Plus. Toy Story Mania. Why don't we book Toy Story Mania for just before thingy? Before lunch? It's yeah. right by there. It's funny, after our, doing our tour yesterday, I'm looking at it all with like a different, through different eyes. Me too. Like understanding why it looks how it does and yeah. the story that it's trying to tell. This is cool. Just as they're about to walk into Avengers Campus, they have a plaque dedicated to Stanley. Oh, okay. oh cool. Oh. <laughs> just met Minnie. This is the little picture. She was just doing hugs and high fives and selfies quickly, which worked perfectly for us. So Spidey is gonna fly across here, which everybody wants to see, in 10 minutes, so we're just waiting for and that. you can see it and in your Disneyland app, if you just type in Spider-Man, yes. it has show times, which I didn't realize, which is good. That is handy. So as we're right nearby and it's less than 10 minutes, we're gonna wait for that. Hey everyone, welcome to Adventures Campus. Woo! Oh, popcorn, I want popcorn. Lucy, My magic band was vibrating. Yeah, I did that. <laughs> I'm not sure if that was impressive on camera, but in real life that was so cool. So cool. Really, really good. I like little things like that. It makes you feel fully immersed. But we're actually leaving Adventures Campus. We're gonna come back and do web slingers later when we're allowed to book another lightning lane. The sign for Cars Land says, Happy Halloween from oh, Cars Land, which is cool. I love the little cones. The like detail. The cones. Yeah, the cones look so good. There's loads of Halloween decks in there, which we'll show you later. Um, but it's quite busy today, as you can see. Actually, change of plan. We're gonna go via this area around here, San Francisco. Oh, this looks so good. The theming's so cool. Thank you so much. <laughs> I would like a sample of sourdough bread, thank you. Look at the little bits of dough. They pop out, go through this little thing, pop out the end. They're doing all sorts in here. Here's the bread, the Baymax bread. So cute. Should we get some? So it was $12.90 something for the bread. I don't think I've ever seen you look so excited about bread before. Isn't it the cutest thing you've ever seen? <laughs> also, how'd you eat it? Like, my first thought is just to chop his head off. Yeah, rip it off. No, we've got some butter, so we're gonna 
cut into it somehow, but it's fluffy on like first impressions. It's, it's so soft, it isn't it? It smells amazing. Proper like sourdough. Mm. Really fluffy, but isn't it just adorable? <laughs> I love Baymax anyway, so yeah, we have to cut into it. <laughs> Sorry, Baymax. Bye, 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 bye. <laughs> Why am I so excited about this? It cost me ten pounds. <laughs> Mm. This is chocolate chip. Is it? Mmm. -hmm. Mm. Disneyland. Beautiful weather. With my boo. Eating Baymax bread. I couldn't actually ask for anything more. Of all like the fancy like snacks and that you can get, like mm. triple chocolate, caramel, swirly things, and just can't be bread and butter sometimes. You just can't. I must say that San Fran bowl thing looks incredible. Mm. You know, like, uh, what's it called? Like clam chowder, isn't the it? Cheese bowl. It smells mm. incredible. We don't have to eat this whole thing. If you put it back in the plastic, we'll, we can nibble on it later. We'll decapitate him, take his arms and legs off, mm. and we'll just leave his little body. We see so many people buying individual water bottles, but we just pack our own, and I can't tell you how many times we've found little refill stations. Look at some more of these details. This is so cute mm. around here. And over here, this is the queue to meet Baymax and he's not even out yet. So as I'm sure you can imagine, it's busy, but everyone wants to do ba la 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 and take a cute picture, which I definitely want to try and do. I have met him before, but it's just so nice here. There's loads of seating too, which I really like. We are coming into Cars Land and I absolutely love it here. We have hit a roadblock. It won't let us buy an individual lighting lane because it says you must be in the US or Canada to purchase this. Well, we are in the US. Why are you not letting us purchase it? Okay, I fixed the app. I had to make sure my location services were turned on in the settings. We've paid for Lightning Lane for Radiator Springs. It was $40, so $20 each, which is about £32. It's expensive, but it's a 75 minute wait, and it was like that all day yesterday. I was just waste part most of the day, won't we? So, sort of. you win some, you lose some, but at least we'll get on it now, won't we? It's true. Oh, I love it. It looks so good everywhere. This ride is so good. Look how lovely this is. So cute. Also, like I'm fully aware of like the force perspective thing in the background, but it still blows my mind. I know. Like, it's like it's miles away. It's so good. <laughs> it's so wild. No. <laughs> Wrong ride. <laughs> because a lot of people are in twos or fours and it's a three and a three. So a lot of the time, a lot of the couples were sitting just one in front of the other. But obviously we wanted to film us to sit next to each yeah, other. Yeah, so. I wanted to do the ride to meet you. But if you had done it once already and you just wanted to do it again. How are you finding your hat, babe? No, I love it. You love it? <laughs> it's, uh, honestly, I've had my hat, my normal hat on this morning. As soon as I put this on, it's so much cooler. Okay, well fair enough. Just doesn't feel that he... I love him so much. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take a picture of you here. Loads of you are asking which camera we're using by the way and it's iPhone 14 Pro Max. Turn around, we want to see your pretty face. We have got 20 minutes until our lunch reservation at Lamplight Lounge which is here on the right of Pixar Pier when you come in. Oh, it's so lovely watching them draw. I could be here all day watching this. You can commission a piece if you want and they have some over here. Wow, look at that one with the light on it. Oh look at Carl and Ellie. So cute. I wish I could draw. They can, you can draw one of your three now. Yeah, true. They've left all the like lines on there. It's really yeah. cool, isn't it? It's almost a like part of it now, isn't it? Yeah. Look at this. This is really holiday to me. 
Ready? We're gonna go on that later. We absolutely love roller coasters. And I will say that Disneyland doesn't quite have as many sort of biggie ones. Space Mountain, sadly, down for renovation at the moment, even though I wouldn't really call that a major roller coaster. I guess it is a little bit. It's the biggest one over there. It is, yeah. We said we would do this before and we haven't done it, so we might just kill some time and do it. It's the La Luna Star Catcher little game. Right, it costs $5. I want the token. Yeah, the token's cute. <laughs> you only need a calling cue. No. I trust you. Small prize. Small prize. Do you get whatever? Yuki Star is more fancy. Ooh, Bonnie is gonna love that. She is our dog. It says Pixar up here on the back. It's so cute. I think that's the best prize to be honest. We won the small prize, but I yeah. I want the boy holding the star. I want the star. I'm the boy holding the star. You are. <laughs> he means he didn't want the main prize up there. <laughs> I love how this looks like a lunchbox with a little apple juice carton on the outside with Zerg. <laughs> we love walking around here. This makes me want to watch Finding Nemo and Finding Dory. How fun is that? They've got loads of lovely posters. Spark a special moment with Wally. And there's a little shop here. It basically has a soft serve and I really want to get one of these at some point. They do like a lemon and a mango thing. Adorable snowman. Frost treats? Is that what it's called? Frosted treats. I love that the other side says adventure is out there from up. So cute. Right, we're gonna go and check in for our reservation at Lampmite Lounge. I love it in here. Look at this detailing up here. Oh, you can't really see, but there's loads of drawings. And the Pixar ball on the umbrella. So I'm just having a look at the seasonal things and I think I want to order this cocktail. They have one thing for Disney 100. We've got our eye on the lobster nachos and the potato skins. The menu is okay, it's not huge. We've ordered three cocktails between us because Benji wanted one on the menu, I wanted one on the seasonal menu, but then because I watch a lot of AJ from Disney Food Blog, she shared about a secret menu. It's a fun wheel cocktail with blue curacao in it, which I thought we would both quite like to try. So we technically have three drinks between two of us. And you know what I'm like on a hot day in Disney. I only need one drink and I'm, I'm whizzy. <laughs> so planning out the rest of our day because it's now time to book another fast bus. So we currently have two, Toy Story Mania and Web Slingers. Web Slingers is not till 4.15. So originally our plan was to sort of do like half day here and then half day over in Disneyland Park. But we still have quite a lot to do here and we, we like being flexible with our plans. So I think it may end up that we spend most of the afternoon here trying to get our credit coaster and a bit more on Pixar Pier. Oh, we're playing Dino Dump. He's bought Dino Dump. It's one of our favorite card games. How to keep your fiance entertained. I'm not sure for who's more entertained, me or you. Me. Cocktail time. This looks amazing, this fun wheel. That's really refreshing. Like a little bit citrusy. Oh yeah, it's really good. That's nice. It's sweet. It's like sweet with, with ginger beer, so. Yeah, I'm not a massive fan of ginger beer. It's nice though. It kind of feels like something you'd have in the Caribbean. Let's try this red thing. That's so cold. Oh my God, that's so cold. That hasn't got a lot of flavor in it. So we've both got potato skins to start, but Benji just said they look like hash browns, yeah, which is do. so They're true. Really good. They look good. They smell amazing. Look at the presentation with the different sauces around the edge. Love it. Let's eat. They have brought out the nachos now, and the potato skins are definitely, like we said, more hash brown than actual skins. They are nice. The portion was just so big, considering they're called bites. You just don't need that much. Like, we didn't need one each, which we thought we were getting a side. I'll definitely share one of these and share one of these, and that's for me. That's, that's plenty, yeah. So, we're going to share these nachos and we'll let you know what we think of these too. What happened? Why is it always the first bite? You spilled it all down yourself. Verdict on the food. The potato skins, I just thought were very average. I really enjoyed them. I think mine were a little bit crispier than yours. Crispier. Yeah. Mine were quite soggy. Was expecting skins. If you call them potato skins, I expect them to be mini jack potato style you know. Four out of ten for those. The lobster nachos. I know that it's lobster, but it is very fishy. They just weren't it. They were $25 and the potato skins were $16 each. So doing the maths, they're very expensive for like a quite light bites lunch it was meant to be it's actually a very expensive meal not it i think if that was like normal like beef mince nachos it probably would have been amazing or like barbecue chicken nachos probably would have been really good we didn't love our meal here last time though did we i remember 
enjoying the restaurant. I don't remember what we had. Hard to snag a reservation, but wouldn't necessarily run back here. In the interest of being transparent, that meal cost $119.60, which came out at 96 pound and 98p absolutely not worth that price probably wouldn't eat here again and wouldn't suggest you come so we got three cocktails we did have some cocktails but i still think that 100 pounds is expensive food was... it just wasn't it never mind we have to go and get some nice treats now instead we picked up a churro because i needed a little pick me up <laughs> so bit of sugar did you get nice i'm closing my eyes <laughs> Ah, <laughs> very good. We have consumed the churro and now it's time for Benji to attempt to defeat me. He always wins on Buzz and I always win on this. I feel like it's normally quite close on this, no? I always win. You know, the problem with Buzz is you know all the boosties. No, you beat me on Buzz. I'm not going to film this one because I need both my hands, but 3D game, everyone wears glasses and you shoot with the little thing, so... We're gonna do this, and then, oh, we need to book another one, don't we? All right, here's the scores. 168,000 to me, 128,000 to Ben. Right, look at the difference in the mobility between these, look. The difference in look. the mobility? Look, 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 look. <laughs> Okay, babe, I'm sure it is. Yeah, that's why you lost. Loser. <laughs> Told you I always been on this one. Benj, I need to go in Bing Bong Sweet Shop. Bing Bong. <laughs> Look at this. The little croissant munchling is so cute. Oh, I like the little straw one, this little ice cream thing. This shop is adorable. Look at how cool this is. With all the sweets down the bottom, and then they have all these munchlings all around the edge. We've got an Encanto range here, which is very pretty. That spirit jersey is really nice. And I've also found one of these pens. And if you know, you know, I collect these and I haven't seen them in years. Look how cute the characters are in their boxes. Woody and Jesse and the aliens and Bullseye. I love it. It's some really cute ones here, but we um, we need to go to the Christmas shop in, in the main park, in Disneyland Park. We love the Christmas shop. We're going to get a Christmas decoration at some point. This little inside out, 30 minutes. Emotional whirlwind. It was 10 minutes on the app a minute ago, but obviously it's busy now in the middle of the day. It's half past one. You can't book another Genie Plus for another hour. What are we doing? Swings. Cool. <laughs> We're going to do uh, Symphony Swings or whatever it's called. Yeah. We're going to try and recreate the photo that we got four years ago. It's an absolute banger. We copied someone on Pinterest, didn't we? I think it takes longer to buckle everyone in than the actual time you get on your thing. All right, so you lift it up and you get in. So elegant. Oh my gosh. Okay, it's a little clip. Goes up. Benji's sat behind me for obvious reasons. Benj, no swinging. Do you mind? I don't want to knock into these people next to me. Stop it. <laughs> Yay! Up we go. just got off the swings I really love the swings you know they were really fun and now we're looking at pins and oh little baby Moana that's so cute this is the Halloween range right now I wasn't sure on it but actually when you see it in the parks this bag looks really good and the spirit jersey it's not my kind of style but it does look really good they've really gone hard on Crocs haven't they yeah what a great partnership for Crocs <laughs> and they glow in the dark that's so fun found some ears that we haven't seen yet these red ones also oh I just realised they've got bunny ears on them ah never mind Oh, that's a shame. Can you take them off? Not really. No. I like them. They're cute. Don't love them. You don't wear a, you don't wear a lot of red, so I don't know what you'd match them with. I have a lot of pink, though. Very nice. Don't love them. Oh, they're quite nice. Hold on. Yeah, they are quite cute. 
I already have some purple aerial ones, but they are really nice. Hello, Daisy. Thank you very much, perfect. I just met Daisy, that was fun. It was a really short queue. That's yeah. a good thing about oh, here. Minutes. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe people don't realize, but she's tucked in this little area here, right next to Carthay Circle. It's also where we met Minnie this morning, so. Yeah, we had one there, one there, and there's one over there. It's like yeah, it's such a lovely right, spot in around here. Corner, isn't yeah. It? I think we've made a decision that it's very, very hot. And she's obviously got dinner down his top. A bit of dribble. I'm feeling very sweaty, and the fans have run out of battery. So we feel like the universe. The fans have run out of battery, which then also means we're, we're out, of out of battery. So we feel like the universe has said, hey, why don't we just chill? So we think we're going to go back to the room, have a freshen up, charge the fans, take an hour, have a shower, have a shower, and then come back Maybe for the swim. evening. Do you know what? I wouldn't say no to a swim. It was too cold last night for a swim. But I'm hot now, so keen for a swim. Yeah, let's see how we go. And then we'll come back out. You can grab a Starbucks on the way out. Yeah. We have arrived back at the hotel, ready for a change of clothes and a nap and a snack. Good job we've got loads of snacks in the room from Target last have, night. Yeah, exciting. So we've come over to the other tower, and this is the uh, gym and second swimming pool. So we thought we'd show you it. We went through the wrong door. This one. Ooh, this is a bit nice. Whoa, is that a tennis court? Oh yeah, and basketball. Oh look, there's loads of games up there. There's a huge fire pit here too, which they obviously light in the evening. Something I really like is they have towels as well, which is absolutely brilliant. I've stolen Benji sunglasses. <laughs> And I'm coming in for bobbin time. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> My hair is curly, but I still don't want to be wet. I fancy mm. reading my book mm -hmm. and lying down on one of those sun loungers. Is that your book with you? No. Oh, are you going to struggle to read it then? I am, I know. I'm just saying that's what I would like to do if okay. I could. I'd like to go to a water park, but here we go. This is the best I could do for you, I'm afraid. Okay. Where's the Lazy River? It's, follow me, yeah. it's here. Okay. Oh, whoa. <laughs> whoa. Oh, whizzy. <laughs> whizzy. <laughs> we have just noticed that the rooms on this floor seem to be a lot more modern. Even the flooring and the actual rooms, they were really nice. We had a little peek in one that was open as we walked past, but anyway, we're going back to our room now. That was very nice. We have had a lovely, leisurely afternoon. After we went swimming, we got in the bed and had a little nap. Benji had a sleep. I was just resting my eyes. I would say you had a sleep and I was just resting my eyes. You were twitching. You know when you fall asleep you're No, I didn't fully sleep, but I was like resting. My eyes were closed, thinking about the day and how much we've achieved and just feeling very content. But I was also thinking about how we're gonna spend the evening. And we were originally gonna go back into DCA and do the final rides that we missed out on. However, we do have two more full days and there's quite a lot in Disneyland Park we haven't done yet. So Toontown and Galaxy's Edge, Batu. Mm -hmm. So I thought it'd be cool if we do Toontown first yeah. while it's light get some cute pictures because i've got this really nice blue dress that's got mickey mini all over it the batu at night is gonna be really cool isn't it? isn't it so i thought that'd be cool with the all the lights and then we can book rise of the resistance and mickey and minis an expensive evening but i feel like it's worth it for the money i'd rather just do it and have it done you know i know me too so the bus has just left at 4 47. Yeah, so, we'll so we need to get the back. next one, which is at quarter past you five. Want yes, I would love a Starbies. Yeah, yeah, we'll Can you show my outfit too, please? Yeah. This is my dress that I got. I love that dress. I put it in Epcot. Um, you did, but yeah. They, I've seen it here in Disneyland's California. Yeah, it must be popular if they're still doing it it's after like a year it. and a bit. Yeah. And you show your flippies. My Javianas that were gifted to me from Javiana themselves. And they, glittery. they match your ears. They do match my ears. And I've got my little coach bag on, which I got from Shop Disney UK. Quite a while ago, actually, mm. in the sale, but I absolutely so love it. So sweet, John, I just show you my bag for the comparison of. Just in case anyone's wondering, this, this is, this is what I've bag. got, which has got all the things in it. But don't mm. worry, Brogan's got, Brogan's got a little bag as well. Hey, I said, do you want me to take my lounge fly and split it up? And he said no. So. Your lounge fly is the same size as that. The lounge fly can fit a few more things in. <laughs> we do have two jumpers. That's why it looks bulky. It's fine. I don't. I, I'd actually rather a full rucksack than an empty rucksack. Not that heavy. I don't know what it is, but an empty rucksack gives me the heebie-jeebies. You don't like that? No, I really don't. 
No. Heebie shebies is what? Don't mind me, I'm just watching cars on the bus with my Starbies. And Benji's catching up with the football. It's the Champions League today, so I'm just catching up on the highlights. Oh, that's what he's doing. Sometimes people wonder what you listen to with your headphones. Football podcasts or some sort of history podcasts. I can't do silence. No. I've <laughs> something going on. <laughs> that's fair yeah. enough. So you're listening to that. I'm watching this. And it takes about 15 minutes. It's the exact scene from... Yeah, it's cool, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Honestly, this bus service is 10 out of 10. Like, I cannot fault this. I love it. It's pretty much been bang on time. Bus, the seats are really um, comfy. Yeah. Really clean. Lovely drivers. Yeah, we're gonna go on into the Disneyland part now. The sun is just setting. Lovely. It's, getting, it's definitely cooler, isn't it? So much cooler. Perfect. Just missed that couple of hours when it was a little bit too, not too warm for us. We were just getting a bit sweaty. We were ready for a break. Too, a bit hot, a bit busy. Yeah. We'd already been out for what, six, six or seven hours. Yeah, we had. And we want to see the fireworks. So I'd rather go back for a nap and a little a little rest yeah then try and power through burn, yeah, yeah and then burn out so. but we've got to figure out if there are even any fireworks or if it's just projections <gasps> it's this song again it's halloween <laughs> hooray oh, oh. <laughs> That's a, that was a cop car <laughs> this song you can't really hear it on the vlog but it's it's um a really old halloween song that i basically have really fond memories of in disneyland paris i've talked about this before in one of my videos that it goes it's halloween now here everybody it's halloween hooray it's halloween maybe we should make a reel with that song maybe i've just had a spark of inspiration <laughs> here we are it's nice and quiet right now and i've only got a little bag <laughs> there is just something special about walking into this park isn't there it's like the castle you've got main street I actually do love the Halloween decorations as well. The, yeah. or, the burnt orange is so nice it's everywhere. It's gorgeous. I love oh, it. Oh, we have to go over here and have a look at the Mad yeah. Hatters. Let's go and look at the pumpkins. Cool. We How found nice this. <laughs> it's really cute. How much is it? It doesn't say. Uh, Happy Halloween t-shirt. I really like it. Part of me is like, okay, so they only have large. Part of me thinks large will look good and will fit me, but 3X I feel like could look cute with cycling shorts, but it would also be a really great uh, pajama. Top, like it's so nice and baggy. And what it is, isn't it? It's like fun. But I kind of would want a 1X or a 2X, so we're like, yeah, we've got I'd no in between. I love this the whole range. It looks good, doesn't I'm it? I said that big, earlier. I'm not a big Halloween guy. But like, really this looks good, good. yeah. yeah. With, With the bag. That yeah, it looks, oh that rucksack, yeah, yeah, it looks cute. Do you even Disney if you don't walk through all of the shops to see all of the merch as you're walking down Main Street? I love it. That's a fun shirt, the Peter Pan one. Yeah, that's really cute. Oh, Crocs, Crocs galore. Yeah, great partnership. Look at that, that's nice. Peter, Peter Pan. Pan's uh, signature, but oh wow, boys. look. But like carved into know, wood like a kids. tree. Yeah. John Darling, Tinkerbell, that's so cute. I love this time of night when the sun's setting and everyone's getting ready to see the second Magic Happens Parade of the Day. It's on at half six. And we're gonna walk through the castle towards Toontown. Wowee, this time of day is just so busy. It's really hard to walk anywhere. But look at the castle. Oh, look at her little balloon. <laughs> wow. So pretty. This is so cute. And look at the back of the castle too. It's so pretty. I love it. I absolutely love it. I love walking through the castle and you get the carousel. Right? Yeah. So nice. Snow White's ride. We haven't done that or Pinocchio's yet. We are heading into Toontown. This is our first time in here since they've redone it. Wow, the amount of <laughs> strollers, prams, buggies everywhere. <laughs> there's so many. Oh my goodness, there's so many. <laughs> oh, this is so cute. It's so fun here, isn't it? It's great that they've added Mickey and Minnie's. It fits perfectly. So we are in Toontown. Mickey and Minnie's is down. It is a lot busier than I thought it was going to be. We have a reservation for what's it called Roger Rabbit ride. So we're going to do that. But yeah, just trying to get a picture somewhere. It's just chaos it ran here. Donald's line was fairly short. So we've just come to meet him. And then we're going to Roger Rabbit. <laughs> Hopefully. We can't pass up opportunities like this, can we? No. Hi, Donald! Donald! <laughs> it's so good to meet you! Here we go! It's a 75 minute wait. Two rides down that we're trying to ride. I'm rested and ready to go. Come I am on. now flagging. I feel like I'm not sure what to do with ourselves. I think maybe we go to Galaxy's Edge. Yeah. Um, 
and We basically want to set up shop for a while, don't we? Well, we wanted to do this while it was yeah. light and then move on, but okay. We've noticed that this time of day has been the most crowded, like between 5 and 7 p.m. It was like this in DCA as well. Yeah. It is so busy. I don't think you can like fully appreciate it, but. It's like a lot of people come after school and work. Yeah, after work, yeah. So we're gonna go to Galaxy's Edge, we're gonna go and do Rise. Then we're going to get a Ronto wrap and then we're going to do Smuggler's Run. So we're going to spend some time in there. And then we're going to watch the projections on the castle. The stormtroopers are up on the balcony. Look at them. <laughs> what a fun job. This time of night as well with the sun setting. This honestly wows me every time. We came in 2018, 19, 2019 when it opened and we were so blown away then. And it just is spectacular. Like it really feels like you're on the planet of Batu. This is more like it. This is nice and quiet. Love it. Did not know you could do that. Rise is currently at 70 minutes. And um, we're going in the lightning lane. This is one of our favorite rides. It's so immersive. We're not gonna film on it, just because we both love to just experience it. But we have filmed on it before. From the moment you step on into the queue, you're immersed, aren't you? You really do feel like you're on a ship and they take you through the different stages and, oh, we'll show the stormtroopers. Yeah. We'll show you some, yeah, until some bits down, yeah. until we go through the main, but it's several sections of the ride. It's just amazing. You don't even have to love Star Wars to appreciate it. It's just amazing. I love the tension to detail. Like you can see the CCTV cameras. Mm. BB-8, is everyone assembled? Good. The Resistance desperately needs your help in our fight against Kylo Ren and the First Order. Remember, it is vital that you keep the location of the Bacara Base secret. This is Black Leader. I hear you're a fine-looking group of recruits. Oh, no time to waste. Let's get you on your way to the general. Look at BB-8 up there. <laughs> That's so cute. So clever. I am Lieutenant Mac. As you heard from Ray, I have been tasked with getting you to Bacara. Raise the shields. Disembark immediately and prepare for interrogation. Get off. <laughs> this is so cool. This is so cool. Bench, do you want to take a selfie with me? This is honestly so, so, so cool. Also, if you look carefully, their heads move and their guns and things. It's so good. It looks like they're breathing. Look, can you see? I hope you can appreciate it because it's so cool. Isn't this just amazing? It's huge too. They must get tired standing there for all day. Oh, like behave. <laughs> he knows that's not actual people. That's stormtroopers. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the detailing up here. I don't think I've ever really like stopped and looked. Normally we're straight from Running those through, yeah. I was going to say, how do they get it so you come out the same door? You come in and out that same because door. Because we got pulled in by a tractor beam into the Federation ship. Oh, do you miss it? We will soon snuff out your meager resistance. You chose the wrong side and now you will pay. You have what I want. You know the location of the secret base and I will take it from you. Absolutely incredible. So good. Incredible how they do some of those things in there. The attention to detail with the lightsabers cutting the wall and the animatronics are just a joke, aren't they? They are insanely like, real. Kylo like, Ren is so good. So we do have Smuggler's Run as well, which we booked on Genie Plus. So that was an individual lightning lane. $25 per person. Good old $50 for that, which was £40. So we're gonna go and get Ronto wraps, aren't we, for dinner? We have got two of the drinks. It's like an iced tea, and then this one is more of a cherry lemonade. Yep. Really nice. You're gonna like that. Let's try this one. Oh yeah. Oh, it's not too tea -y. No, tea -y. Oh, that's really nice actually. It tastes like it's sweet. Here are the Ronto wraps. They come in a little box. Ronto wraps are the bangers. The breakfast Ronto wrap is amazing as well, but these basically have sausage in. Coleslaw. And coleslaw, yeah. You can't really appreciate it as it's now dark, but they are amazing. So you can have the one in the box. Mm -mm. 
We actually have a massive list of recommendations from you guys and lots of you that are local or annual pass holders, but we've just been like grabbing stuff as we are hungry or is nearby. But we've, we fancy at the time. Yeah, but we do have a bit of a list and we've just looked through it. And I think tomorrow we're gonna try and do a bit more food stuff. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss all the extra food things we end up doing in the next vlog. So I feel like I want to go a bit more food heavy. I feel like the only thing that Galaxy's Edge is missing is like a banger dessert spot. Do you know what I mean? With some like Star Wars themed puddings. We're gonna get our snacks for the parade, aren't we? They're for the projections. Projections, are there fireworks? We don't know, it's gonna be a surprise. It's gonna be a surprise when there's no fireworks. There's getting there, I don't think there are. I'm watching yeah, no. you. <laughs> We'd hate to question your loyalty to the First Order. Just having a moment for it all lit up in the dark and I don't think I've really noticed that you can actually see inside. That's really cute. But now it's all dark. This is so cool at I night. I love the blue lights on the rock formations. Yeah, it looks amazing. It's so good. We're waiting to go to Smuggler's Run because we have a lightning lane. To be fair, the standby is only 20 minutes, which is pretty good, but we do have a lightning lane, so obviously we're using it our magic band plus keep buzzing and flashing and doing all sorts around here i feel like they've been doing more here than in florida yeah we've really had them interactive here trying to fly away from in front of things in florida yeah do you remember oh my gosh it wasn't working we were getting so frustrated, frustrated yeah <laughs> this is so fun at night i really love it this was a good idea on our part oh the details guys it's so cool Wow, it really is quiet, isn't it? This is much nicer. Maybe we'll find it much easier to navigate this evening. We can go and do Big Thunder in the dark. We could potentially do Pirates. We've still got the rest of the night in us. I think with a couple of sweet, sugary snacks, we could be onto a, onto a winner. Bash out a bit more, a few more rides. Okay. Cool. Welcome, my friends. Welcome, welcome. What a fine looking group of flight professionals. Today, I am offering the opportunity of a lifetime. I need flight crews to transport this valuable merchandise across the galaxy. I've done this several times now and every time I still think it's amazing. Wow, look how cool it is, all the details. I want to touch everything. Are these actual buttons? Oh, they are, look. Does that do anything? I don't think it does. Fun to touch though. You will be intercepting a first order training shipment of Coaxia. Did you enjoy being the pilot, babe? I did. I did. You did a good job, man. I think we did well on that one. I think so. The first time we did it as pilot, you were both well, we were both going, go left, go right, go up, go down. <laughs> this time we didn't have any shouting, did we? <laughs> it was good. It's such a cool concept. Isn't it? it is cool. You really feel like you're flying the Millennium Falcon. So we got here an hour before. There's definitely no fireworks. And it was so hard to find a space. We've got one. In a seated area right at the front there is a tree kind of in the way but it's the best i could do and we're waiting for the projections then she's got a mickey sugar cookie he loves them you're putting a torch on so you can see it there we go whoa sugar cookie and i have got the churro toffee that everyone told me to get everyone has tried this all week uh, it looks very basic and plain but mm -hmm. I'll let you know how it is. I don't think you're going to be able to appreciate this, but this is really tasty. It's toffee, but it's not chewy or gooey or whatever. It's like, kind of tastes like a Werther's original, but I don't know, hard. It just, it tastes good. I like it. Oh wow, that's so good. Oh my gosh. Happy Halloween, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Quickly wanted to add. Obviously, I couldn't film that whole show, 
and I did notice that there was something on the far left being projected, but we couldn't see that, we had no idea. So by the looks of it, you want to be on the left-hand side of the castle if you're going to be A side. Mm, it's only running until the 31st of October, it's clearly a Halloween special, special thing, but I think it really lacked fireworks. It really just felt like it was missing something. You know at the end of like Happily Ever After or, fun, or like another show, yeah. everyone's like, yeah! There was like a solid like five second gap where I was like, and you can hear everyone go, oh. Yeah, it only was nine minutes long, so it really wasn't. It needed fireworks. It, yeah, and it felt like for the hour wait on the floor, it yeah. was a long Most wait backs for, and bits. same, for very little reward. It wasn't for us, but I do appreciate the projections that they do, and it did feel like Halloween-y. Maybe we would have felt differently if we watched like it tomorrow. music, I do like, this is Halloween, this is Halloween. Now we're going to go and do Mickey Minis because it's back open. It's actually only got a 20 minute wait, also, but... Also, I went to go and get some snacks, and the whole of Main Street was just one solid block leaving. So hopefully, it's a lot quieter. Yeah, let's go and do some rides. Do it. Alrighty, we're trying again and actually, look how pretty it is all lit up at night. It's so cute around here now. You want to sing the theme song for us? <laughs> Nothing can stop us now. I don't know how. Oh, there's so much more detail in this queue. There's a whole section there. Wow, look at the bit in the middle here. This is so cool. This doesn't look like the same in Florida. Oh, this is fun. This Mickey's is birthday cake. party cake. Us. This is a prop cake. It's not real. Trust us, we tried it. <laughs> wow, look at all this stuff. Oh, I love it. Hey, there's loads to look at, isn't there? I'm not gonna bother filming this because every time I try to edit it in, I get copyrighted. This is still so cool how they do this. This is real Disney magic. <laughs> I mean, if we're serious about the height of fashion, then <laughs> that is wow. No, no. no, we already bought one hat. We don't need another one. Is there anything on the back of this one? Oh yeah, Mickey and Minnie's running away. Right That's cute. Just noticed this little model train going around the top of the store. I want one. All right, they've got some really sweet things. Love the t-shirt, and I also love this cool bag but Benji said no <laughs> I really I really love it I mean look how cute that is so fun what a little hidden gem yeah we had no idea that was a thing before we got here did we no really cute we're jumping on the carousel because this is one of the original opening day attractions and it's beautiful at night look at the lights so we have to go on this uh, what are you doing we're getting ready to go <laughs> 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 Nailed it. You look identical. Oh my goodness. Off we go. One more time, Nene. Nene. 
the wildest horse in the wilderness. Castle. Castle. See what you see? Let's see what you It's just crazy that this is an opening day attraction. Aww. This one says honorary ambassador and it's so pretty. And look, it's got Mary Poppins. I think this is the one that was dedicated to um, Julie Andrews. That's why it says JA on it. Yeah, Mary Poppins. Isn't it pretty? So there we go, now you know. So because we couldn't get on Roger Rabbit earlier, they issued us one of those passes that we can use on any ride that has a lightning lane. We figured that it was maybe better to go on Big Thunder over trying to do Roger Rabbit again. Uh, it'd be cool at night as well, won't it? Cool at night, so we're probably not going to film it because we yeah, actually be seeing anything, yeah. Our nap's starting to pay off now, isn't it? Yeah. Our break. Yeah. It's what, 5 to 11, 11 o'clock, and we're still going. It's open till midnight, actually, by the way. <laughs> well, that was fun in the dark. It felt so much faster, didn't it? It did, yeah. It was really good. It was really fun. I'm really glad we got to do that. Yeah. We got a bit lucky with the fast pass situation, yeah. Genie Plus. We got upgraded a fast for a uh, Genie Plus for a uh, Lightning Lane from Roger Rabbit to Big Thunder Mountain at night. At night, yeah. Pirates and Jungle Cruise are five minute wait, so everything's getting a bit quieter now. So we've been on Pirates, we're heading on out. We thought we'd just pop back into the Opera House to say goodbye to you. It's been a really good day. It has been amazing. It's been very long. I feel like we achieved a lot. I agree. And well, we've done over 20,000 steps. Whew, big day, big day. So thank you so much for watching this vlog. We'll be back again in the next one with a Halloween party, Oogie Boogie Bash. If you haven't already, make sure you hit subscribe so you don't miss us going to Oogie Boogie Bash. And on that note, thanks so much for watching. We'll see you again in the next one. See you later. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>